channel, what is up everyone, Serge here, and for today's video, we are going to do a quick tutorial on how to prepare the main engine using virtual engine room simulator from cold seat to navigational full speed ahead. So first, we are going to do a puncturing operation, so go to fuel, let's fill up our MDO storage tank from port engine. And from MDO storage tank, going to MDO storage tank using hand pump. Next, from power side port intake, prepare the bunkering line, fill up our port tank, center tank, and starboard tank of heavy fuel oil. Okay, next. Let's close the MDO intake valve and let's proceed to lubricating oil system while waiting for the fuel to fill up. So let's uh, fill up the main engine lube oil tank number 1, number 2 and BGLO tank. And from main engine tank, let us also fill up the main engine sump tank. So just by using the big line. Next, cylinder oil storage tank from port intake. And then from storage tank going to service tank using cylinder oil pump. Okay, so um, our low oil sump tank now is in normal level. So let's close. Okay, close the gravity line and also close the intake valve. Next, let's stop the CO pump and then we can now start the lubricating oil circulating pump number one, LO booster pump number one, and put number two on standby. Let's also include the LO heater. Let's check our fuel oil system. So I think this is enough. Next, let's go back to lubricating oil system, stern tube. And then we're going to uh, fill up the LO gravity tank, lower and upper, using stern tube circulating pump. So switch to auto. And then intermediate class bearing, let's also fill up. To fill up the upper gravity tank, just press the three-way valve. And then, uh, stern tube bearing LO in it valve to be open. Okay, and also... Okay, so... Lubricating oil system and stern tube system is already good to go. Now let's proceed to domestic water. Okay, so from port intake, we're going to fill up domestic water tank number one and tank number two. Okay, and from domestic water tank number one, we're going to fill up hydro four tank using domestic water pump number one, switch to auto. And then we're also going to fill up our separator operating water tank and Freshwater expansion tank. Okay, so let's go back to domestic water and then let's close the port intake manifold. Separator operating water tank and pulling water expansion tank. So we already have no water, so let's start the CC pump number one, LT pump number one, two water pump number one, and all number two pumps should be on standby. Okay, so our lubricating oil system and cooling water system is already good to go. So let's do two complex air system so that we can prepare our uh, air starting system. So here, we are just going to open all the valves except the drain. Okay. 
and then start the emergency compressor main compressor number one and number two should be in auto okay so from here we're going to wait until the pressure become normal next let's proceed to our fighting system so let's prepare the ventilation system okay open the ventilation system here in the bridge and let's start the supply fan and exit fan okay next we're going to power plant so let's prepare this generator number one and number two okay Air starting, fuel, lubricating oil system, cooling, and we're going to start it in manual. Okay, let us also start number two. And then we're going to connect number one generator to main back down. And the number two should be synchronized. Okay. Next, our power plant system is already good to go, so let's go to okay. so let's prepare our um, fuel water system. Fill up the fuel tank, and from the fuel tank, going to hot well tank using hot well pump. And from hot well tank, going to boiler drum using fuel pump. Number one, in water. Okay, so let's start the fuel pump. Set the burner and we're going to start it in open. Okay, so while waiting for the tank to be filled up, uh, uh, so next will be After one bar, we're going to close the vent valve, and second bar, we're going to open the main steam valve. Okay. So now let's go in, uh, let's go to prepare our fuel oil system so from 4 tank, center tank, power supply, storage tank, so we're going to fill up our second tank number 2 using tank first tank. Okay. And then from each of our second tank, going to fill this tank using this is all purifier or separator. Okay, after filling up the uh, equipment service plan, we're going to start the fuel oil circulation tank number one, fuel supply tank number one, and oil number two to be on standby. From here, we're going to wait for the equipment to be in our model, and we can now start to prepare our managing for housing. Okay. Using turning gear, at this point, the duration of the plan shot.
Next, I'm going to blow up our main engine. So the control mode to be control room. So let's put it on standby. Good for now. And I'll go up and press the digital line. Tell him that to be an option and control mode to be in green. Okay. Start the auxiliary blower. Press the reset button and then you should now give the control to the B. Okay. Next, steering wheel. Okay, the supply power to be on and control mode to be in remote. And the drive unit number one to be on and bridge and number two to be on standby. Okay, uh, let us now start the main engine. Go ahead, up ahead, pull ahead, and the position of the foot ahead, very good at the end. So it is at the end of the road to be maximum, so it will come to place. Thank you. 